Hello everyone, welcome to my first Warframe video, which is just going to be Warframe Fashion. Now, basically what this is going to be is what kind of like my ideal outfits for um, certain characters. Today we'll be only doing Limbo, Loki, and Nidus. Now for Limbo, uh, this is what I call the Limbo Royal set. And we'll be going over the color palettes right now. So, the primary color is this dark gray, I believe. I think it's a dark grayish blue in the classic saturated color palette. While the secondary is this white opposite of the black we just used, used in the same color palette. Um, and just about all of this right here is from the saturated, classic saturated. And then we'll be using this gold right here as a ter tertiary from Classic Saturated. And this gold right here for the accents. Now emissive, you'll take that same, same dark color and a purple from this one right here to be specific from the infested color palette. And the energy is just any of these sort of lime greens here from the infested color palette. The reason lime green is just because I think it kind of meshes well surprisingly with it. Now the Cyandana is mostly the same same colors we had before right here and accents with the gold and some emissive and green energy although my emissive on Limbo himself is purple it's like but it's this thing right here and then kind of like the back shine of the hat so oh yeah and you can see what skin and helmet I'm using from here and of course I'm using Limbo's Noble animation set um, which is this little mystical magical one now moving on to Nidus now I call this my like royal Limbo now we'll be moving on to Nidus Nidus, I call this one, uh, no, I call this f my festering wound, Nidus. Now let's get into the colors. So the colors are mostly in classic saturated. But we have this dark red for the primary, yeah, um, from saturated. And for the secondary and tertiary, I think it's the same. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's the same. I'm probably gonna, yeah, I'm. I'm going to change it to this. So for the secondary it's going to be the same color we just used for the primary and then the tertiary is this red right here from the um, classic saturated. Now the accents is this right here and then the emissive is just this same red up here which is this veiny veiny look on Nidus in case you didn't know and the energy is the same red so um, for this brighter red it's just gonna be this top corner right here alright and then no animation sets okay I don't remember that I'm supposed to have the agile animation set to have more of that beast like thing and then Cyandana is the mus m mucusk has about a similar color palette. Um, but I mostly use like the darker colors here, so I'm gonna just try to get those to match now. So as you can kind of see, right here, and then like right here, and yep, there we go. Now I got the side signed on a correct hold on, wait. Ah, so I can change those. I didn't know you could. Well, we're going to change that to a. Oh, well, you we can change that to a darker color, so we'll just have it match. I'm just going to check the other emissive, see if that, see what that changes. I don't know why I never checked this before. And I left the energy the same, but it's supposed to be red. Alright, there we go. Festering Wound Nidus. And of course, I use, I'm use i using the Agile just because it's more beast-like. Kind of more the infested. 
I don't know, because more of a beast-like stance, because if I go in, wait, appearance, if I can do that, alright. Because if we go into the noble one, he just stands up straight. Unlike this one, which is more beast-like in appearance, which is why I'm using that one. Hold up, we weren't done. Alright, now moving on to Loki. And the low levels is just because I don't, I, I'm not that far in this game because of a reset I've had to go along with and whatnot. But I call this my Void Loki. Now here's the thing: in case you can't see it from base value, this is a monochromatic um, color palette. So everything you find here is going to be some form of blue or another. If it's not, and you are trying to recreate this color, if you're trying to recreate this color palette. And not all of these colors are some shade or tint or hue of blue. You're doing it wrong. <laughs> I'm just going to say that out loud. And the reason I call this Void is because the Void in-game is like a blue. It's, <laughs> it's blue, so. But this color right here is just this really dark blue from Classic Saturated. The secondary is a very... Is this blue down here from the Infested. The tertiary is this blue right here from Classic, um, saturated. Accent is this blue down here. Emissives are this blue down here and this blue up here. Then energy is that blue, although I'm going to change it to this blue. Now the Cyandana is the Yamok Yama Yamako Cyandana blue and just a little lighter than the one we were using on Loki. Secondary is this blue right here. The tertiary is this blue. The accent is also this blue. The emissive is this blue right here. You can go lighter if you want. I might do that. I'm, yeah, I think I might go with this one, just because that kind of brings off more of the brighter void colors. All right, yeah, yeah. There's like a little hue value you can use here. So if you want to kind of blend the colors a little bit, I'm going to do that right here. Yeah. Now that that was which blue is that? It's not the right one. Help me. There it is. So this dark blue up here. Then energy. I'm going to change that back to this very teal blue here. And there you go. You got Void Loki. And um, I used to use a different sign down. I used to use the um, the Rapala. Sindana. So I used to use this one, but I kind of decided against it because it didn't really fit Loki. Oh yeah, my animation sets, well, okay, it's supposed to be the Agile animation set, kind of like someone derived from the Void, but I decided, meh, I don't really care for that. So there you go, there's my fashion. Now I will release more for when I get Harrow and Excalibur Umbra because those are two other frames I actually plan on using. So there you guys go. I hope you enjoyed and see you next time.